Welcome to week three, day one in our series, and when you pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Give. God is our provider. He's our source. And when we ask for him to give, we recognize that our Father is the source of all things. In 1 Corinthians, it says, For us, there is only one God, the Father, who is the source of all things. In Philippians 4, it says, My God will supply all your needs according to his riches in glory in Christ Jesus. And finally, in James chapter 1, every good thing given and every perfect gift is from above, coming down from the Father of lights. Today, would you recognize that God is the source of all good things, that he's your provider, that when we ask we're asking our Heavenly Father, who is the source of all things. Today, as we pray, we're going to acknowledge that God is the source and owner and the supplier of all good things. So would you join with me in prayer today? Father, thank you that you are the source that we don't look to our job, we don't look to our 401k, we don't look to money or to people or to our employers. Father, we look to you. So when we ask, give us today our daily bread, we recognize that everything comes from your hands. Father, may we not be distracted by all of the things in the world that pull us, that tug us away, from recognizing that you are the one who gives. Jesus, I pray that we might have a revelation of the knowledge of understanding that you supply according to your riches and glory. And so today, would you take a few moments and would you thank God for what he has given to you and then, after you thank him for what he's already given you, would you thank him for the things he's yet to give? Take just a few moments and pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. 